in most uh, Joomla templates uh, in the past year, roughly, or since Joomla 1.5 came out, they've got a footer module that you'll notice here. Uh, when you click on that footer module, this is regarding the, um, the footer on your website, obviously. It shows the Joomla copyright information. And we can choose to publish that or not. Obviously, if we say, hey, let's go, let's disable that. We'll hit apply, come back to our page, and refresh. And you'll notice that it disappeared. It was sitting down here. It was the copyright information. So let's actually enable that again. And let's apply. We'll come back and refresh again. We'll see some copyright information show up right here. This stuff here. So uh, you notice that we've edited this file to say 9999clients.com. So in order to edit this file, we need to use our FTP program to go into uh, the file structure and actually edit the, uh, the footer file. And in Joomla 1.5, that is located inside the language folder inside your website. So when you go to, when you're FTP'd in your main site, uh, we're going to go into the language folder and then the en-gb folder. And we're going to scroll down and we're going to open up this footer.ini file. And what that looks like when you see it is... Uh, looks right here. So this is actually for a different website. So if we've got uh, the line 2 would say 99clients.com We can save this here. You can tell that this is going to have the copyright copyright symbol. It's going to have the 2010 the site name. You can edit all of this and actually just get rid of put whatever you want change delete all of that add whatever you need there on footer line 1 and line 2 uh, and then upload it back into your FTP once you've made the edits uh, locally upload it back and replace this .ini file uh, and then when you come back to it and refresh it it'll be whatever you over whatever you put in basically so it's pretty straightforward you're going to need to FTP and download the file if when you download the thing and you're looking at it in notepad this is what it looks like in notepad so if you can if you're comfortable noodle noodling through that you can see the line footer line one here's all that same text that we edited you don't want to delete this footer line two so make sure you stop after the period uh, and then footer line 2 is actually a URL to this Joomla site and uh, these kinds of things. So you can keep coming down all the way to about right there. And that's probably where you'd want to stop. So that's how to edit the footer uh, module in Joomla 1.5. And uh, hopefully that was helpful. You can obviously replace it with anything you want. You can put an image in there if you'd like. Um, what we suggest too, again, is once you have your module map, you'll quickly be able to see where you can add stuff. So a lot of the new templates have module positions that are even below uh, below this area here, below the Powered by Joomla, uh, and maybe even down in this area here, you could create your own custom module and publish it in a module position that's at the bottom of your site and use that as your footer. So, uh, But for these purposes, that's how to edit this uh, the footer module. Thanks.